ChatGPT is going to be in working with analytics. AI will automatically generate a formula based on their uh, business need. This saves a lot of time. Just by writing the query and that magically it will just show the result. What For is ML? Automatic machine learning platform. So this is machine like really AI, creating, yes. creating your own platform. AI. Yes. So Gomati, thank you very much for being with us today. You're and welcome. thank you for inviting us to Chennai, India. Sure. Uh, we've been here for a few days. We got lots of information about the products and about Zo, and it's fantastic. So thank you for being on this session. You're always welcome. Thank you. Thank you. So Gomati, you're with the partner team. You're in charge of uh, the analytics. And we like to know how business owners Simple people like myself, without background in coding and all the crazy stuff, how can we take advantage of analytics? How can we get reportings that are making sense for us? Is it possible? Is it going to happen in 2025? Yes, we have already introduced AI features which are very easy for the end user or business user who don't have any knowledge, technical knowledge about the product. They can simply uh, use this uh, AI integration to generate queries, uh, formula columns, or they will, can create a data set, they can uh, create reports, dashboards and much more without any technical knowledge. But how it's working? So let's say that I will go into the analytics. Okay. Is there an interface or something that I will, I will just talk to it or I will need to write down something? How it works? Yes, once you have logged into Zoho Analytics, you have already integrated ChatGPT with Zoho Analytics. So ChatGPT is going to be working with analytics? Yes, awesome. we have an integration with ChatGPT. So once you have set up this integration, or you, you can, uh, you, for example, let's consider you have a table and you just need to create a formula for your business. Uh, what table means for, for a business owner? What, what a raw a set of data. So like the deals module uh, or yes. the leads. Yes. Got it. Yes. Okay. The module, uh, which, which should be synced as table in Zoho Analytics. In CRM, it is a module, but in Zoho Analytics, it is a table. The raw set of data. So when the information is being synced into yes. analytics and that's done automatically, right? Yes, yes. Then it will be a table. Yes. Awesome. Uh, let's consider the fields which are lead name, uh, address information will be synced as a column in Zoho Analytics in a table. Okay. See, uh, they have a table where they need to create a, a profit and loss uh, formula over the data set. In that case, once you, they have integrated uh, chat GPT with Zoho Analytics, uh, they can uh, simply enter their query in a natural language like generate a profit and loss formula. This AI will automatically generate a formula based on their uh, business need. This saves a lot of time. Oh, of course. So just to make sure I understand, I will go to Zoho Analytics. X. And I will just write something that a human would write, such as create a report that will know how to grab the information from the amount, expected revenue. Because all this information will be available in the table, it will fetch that information and generate a formula based on your query. And the system is smart enough to understand which fields to extract yes. in order to produce the report. Yes, you're correct. What if I would like to make it more difficult? Okay. For example, let's say that I will have the deals okay. and the leads okay. and I will want to know which lead sources converted the most okay. or how much money I got from each lead source for a given time from January 6th until February 12, whatever. Yes, this complex query also can be uh, generated using our uh, AI, open AI integration with Zoho Analytics. You can input this uh, question in a natural language so that using the keywords like uh, income in the, uh, based on the lead source, you, you just need to input the keywords to the ASIA functionality so that uh, the system will uh, predict the uh, data based on your keywords and it will generate a query for you. And once the query is generated, you can create a report over that. So once you create the report, so let's say, as you said, profit and loss for 2024. Yes. Once the report is generated, is it being saved in the system or I need to do the same query again and again? 
No, once you have uh, generated a query using this uh, OpenAI integration, it, you, it will ask you to save it. Yes, you can save it in the uh, in your workspace so that you can use it later. Okay. In Zoo Analytics, from my understanding, you have dashboards. Yes. A dashboard will be a bunch of reports yes. and the visual representation of what's going on in my business. Can I take this report of the profit and loss and put it in this dashboard? Yes, you have an option to customize it based on your need as well. Okay. In the dashboard, there is a way to slice the information based on user filters. So yes. I, can, I can change the date range, yes. lead source. Will that be also available on the generated report? Yes, the report will be generated using this integration. And if you wish to customize it, you can add filters or you can do whatever customization you need on the dashboard. So you're saying whatever I would do with a developer that will cost me $1,000 for a report, I can do it just by writing the query and that magically it will just show the result. We have option to create a queries, formula columns. Based on that, you can, we have option to generate a report as well. If you wish to see certain uh, business reports for, the, for your company for your last, last month or last year, you can just, uh, you can see the revenue growth of your company last year. You can input your query in the natural language to Asia. The report generated in your workspace will be automatically shown for your quicker reference. Super. So you're saying, if I would like to have a report that will show me the customer name, account name, how much money, lead yes, source, yes. I will just say, show me the contact name, account name, yes. amount, closing yes. date, lead source yes. for uh, 2024. Yes, it will show. But you should have the data set before uh, inputting the query. Of course, without data, there's nothing. Yes, you're correct. What about um, creating dashboards? Is that also an option or I can create only the reports that will live inside the dashboards? Yes, a dashboard is uh, basically a collection of reports. Once you have created the reports, you can add it to the dashboard. And how difficult is to add a report to a dashboard? It is not at all difficult. Already you have created a dashboard. It will be available in the left pan. You just need to drag and drop the report into the dashboard. That's it. So, so it's a simple... It's a simple task. Got it. What else? Are you planning for us for 2025? We already have an option to fetch the reports and dashboards from different AI platforms like uh, Power BI Tableau. You can create a report over there. You can also fetch that report inside Zoho Analytics. And that's, that's a native integration and you need a developer to do it for you? No, it is not a native integration. We have a concept called portals. Using that, BI Fabric portals, you, you can uh, create a report in your uh, Power BI Tableau and that information can be fetched inside Zoho Analytics and you can create a dashboard inside Zoho Analytics. Beautiful. Yes. What else? I um, want more. And also we have introduced uh, ML models. Uh, what is ML? Automatic machine learning platform. So this is like really AI, creating, yes. creating your own platform. AI. Yes, we have two types using code and non-code. We have uh, Code Studio where you need to import the data from Python in order to generate reports and dashboards. And we also have a codeless one where our system will uh, uh, train the AI to generate the report based on your uh, use case. And training means uploading data so it will know what I want? Uh, you need to uh, train the AI in order to get the uh, better results, no? Based on your keywords. Got it. Okay. Fantastic. Thank you very much for, for being with me today. I learned a lot. And the most important thing, I can do things without developers. Yes. Which that's, that, that's a big thing. Yes. Thank you very much for being with me today. You're welcome.